Hey. Works. Huzzah. All right. Bam. We got this. So, here's a story, All right? My friend lent me this game. I already played it. It, it was cool. Oh, that's the zombies. I know who you are. Oh, I got another good one for you. Oh, yeah, this happened. Ow. Looks painful. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. And you, you keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly, you'll shift in with Doug. You Why did it, she boss. look so high there? <laughs> I'm confused on how he One didn't get bitten. there. Like, what? We the kick zombie was like, hey, that's what I'm saying. You want a little something, something. <laughs> <laughs> God. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you, but if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, <laughs> you watch your ass. You're a dick. I don't like that guy. I don't think anybody likes that guy. He's a dick. We get it. We get it. Telltale. Blah, blah, blah. Video games. It's a great game. We should go play it. Oh, it's me. Okay, hello to- Ah! Got them Gucci clothes. Let's go. Damn it. What'd they get this time? Who the fuck is this monster? Uh, looks like a ass? rabbit. I want a uh, rabbit. Well, that's another meal lost. Shit. <clears throat> I still can't Have believe- Have you ever eaten rabbit? Oh my god, rabbit's good. All food in three months. It seemed like so much at the time. Maybe you shouldn't have opened the door. Yeah, except then I'd probably be food by now. Trust me, I have no regrets. Uh, rabbit's hardly a meal, Mark, but I'd take it. We're all hungry. No kidding. I'm hungry. When I accidentally grabbed for Carly's rations the other night, I thought she was going to take off my hand. We're all on edge. Just cut us some slack. Yeah, you're right. I wish I knew for sure how much food we have left. Uh, not enough. enough. According to Lily, we've just about hit the last of our food reserves. Some people might have to go without tonight. You mean Lily's um, lottery again? Kenny's gonna be pissed. She thinks I'll probably do the entire season at some point. Me. You think Kenny's having? But I would need to go back to episode one to do that. I sure hope so. All I need to do this episode yeah, the to complete it is just feed Clementine a battery, then I'll be good. Are getting pretty tense That's really it. That's all I'm here for. You know, Kenny's been Clementine talking about batteries. taking off if he can get that RV running. Kenny won't abandon us. He's a good man. Kenny's cool. Well, I guess we'll see. Can't blame him, though. Did you hear Larry going off on him last night? What's the old guy's deal, anyway? Seems Larry's like he's a got dick. a problem with you in particular. Herb. He thinks I'm a danger to the group and Clementine. I think he's the one putting us in danger. Right? The way Lily worries about his health, I wouldn't be surprised if she's been skimming rations for Better him. Better is our. I, know I wouldn't want to be stuck in a room with him. And didn't he punch you in the face one time? He did. Uh, knock me flat. It hurt. Lot. Burb. Oh, totally eat that bird. Don't. Gunshot will bring walkers. No birds I mean, if you had like a crossbow, that'd yeah, be I fucking know. amazing. I'm just really freaking hungry. Well, so are they. And 
You could have been their meal. Well, See, that happened. Is that Kenny? I don't know. Come on. I like how this is supposed to be an intense moment and I'm just really chill. Ah! Like, dude. Burn. Oh, hey. Calling a bear trap. Jesus Christ. Oh, shit. No, no. Please don't kill us. We just want to help our teacher. We'll leave, I swear. Lee, you guys okay? Oh, hey, it's Kenny. Get, get oh. it off. Get it off. God damn it. Get, get it off me. What up? Travis, maybe they can help. These might be the same guys that raided our camp, and we barely got away from that. What guys? Why the fuck is there a bear what? trap out here? What, what the hell happened? Mr. Parker said we should stay off the streets. Mr. We were Parker, trying to be careful, he does just but... walk. Uh... Lee, this is fucked up. I know, Mr. Parker. Please. Ben, shut up. My dad was special forces. I know what I'm doing. Oh, yeah. Just see if ben. you can get him out. After that, you can leave us or whatever. I don't care. Please. Fucking PewDiePie looking ass. Oh. Uh, gotta get him out of here. Like, oh, there's God, no point you. in not trying. Fine, but you gotta hurry. <clears throat> like, if you can help somebody, hurry, then go hurry. ahead and do it. Like, dude. Just shut Lee, the this trap fuck been up. Altered. There's no release latch. Like, if you just keep making all that noise, you're gonna attract the thing. So, oh. Shit. Look, there's noise over He'll here. Never leave. Oh, look at this dumbass Get screaming. Oh, look this. like he's a new Mark, snack. Get the boys back. Om nom nom. Kenny, keep those walkers off of me. Oh, well, what? Uh, you have great to get shit. You have to. Oh, no, no, no. Stop. Oh, Please, do something. Oh, please. Please. Do this. All right. Stop, stop, stop. Please stop. hurry. What, what do you want me to... You know what? Fuck Try your life. Try to cut the chain. Try to cut... Wait, cut the... Oh, God. No, no, no! Let's Try the trap again! Anything, please! Hurry! Uh, uh. It has to be now! This is an option. This is an option. I never knew about this. I was. Oh, uh, fuck that. Try something. Alright, you know, this guy's. Just cut off his fucking leg! Just got, okay, I got Don't you, Kenny. Time for that. Got I'm you. sorry, but we right. have to go now! Choice. Oh, go ah! You know, if I would do this, I would have missed that spot and hit another spot. Oh god, there's so many of them. Fuck, I'm just still on there. Now. We gotta go. <laughs> well, you're free. Oh god. Yes. Shit. Is he? He passed out. If he's alive, grab him and let's go. You know. If one of you were smart, you would like take your shirt off and bandage that shit up. But no. Behind you, Travis. Not necessarily. Come on, come on, we gotta move. The fuck is this kid doing? What is going on? Oh. I can, just, I can just feel the no! pouring off of him. And there we go. As far as he left it this long. Trophy Aaron going hungry. I'm going hungry right now, I goddamn. Got some water here. Water's good. Dark for help. Ha! I get it! It's a joke! Starved! Uh, going hungry? Uh, it's funny. Oh, hey, battery girl. That's impressive how it just stops like that. Holy shit. Can you teach me your ways of fucking physics manipulation to make the ball stop right in front of your foot? Or, you know, and then kicks it. Already got a few shoot me. That that intense focus.
I can do that too. Blair's just gonna give him the stink eye, like, mm, get out of here, I'll punch you when you're. Get the gates open! Oh shit, we got what wounded! Up? Shit! What the hell are they doing? Being assholes and come dumbasses. On, come on. And both. What happened? Oh, 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 I don't know. Lee! What the hell? You can't just be bringing new people here. What are you thinking? Hey, you want to calm down for a fucking hey, minute? No, I don't. I mean, I like... want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. He would have died if we left him. So what? We are not responsible for every struggling survivor we come across. Well, you we don't have, have to, to be focus asshole. on like, our all we need group to do is just pack right them up here, and send them right away. now. Well, hang on. We haven't even talked to these people yet. Maybe they can be helpful. Come on, Lily. These are people. People trying to survive just like us. We've got to stick together to survive. I mean, that's true. Like, why don't we just... Had food. Enough for all of us. I don't understand how the U.S. military gone. wouldn't We've be able got to deal maybe with maybe a week's worth left. And I don't suppose you guys like, are carrying any groceries. Like, I don't know. Is this happening all over the world or just no? in America? In Fine. This game? You guys fight it out there. <laughs> Welcome to the family, kid. Come over here and see what I drew. Wait, what? No, I... Just come ben, on, okay? Go with battery, girl. You like girl. to think you're the leader of this little group? But we can make our own goddamn decisions. This isn't your own personal dictatorship. Dandy. What the shit? Oh, come on. You're being dramatic. <clears throat> Everything always turns into a power struggle between you two. I'm not gonna be a part of that. Hey, I didn't ask to lead this group. Everyone was happy to have me distributing the food when there was enough to go around, but now that it's running out, suddenly I'm a goddamn Nazi. Kenny's right. Yeah, you're in charge of the food and the schedules, but you're not in charge of people's lives. Really? It was our decision, you there. so fucking Lee deal made with a it. Choice. End of story. Look, once Katja patches that guy up, you can kick him out of here. Send him out on their own. I couldn't care less. But they at least deserve a fighting chance against the walkers. And for the record, Kenny wanted to leave those people behind. If Kenny would pull his head out of his ass for five seconds, he'd <clears> realize <throat> that I make these decisions to protect his family. We simply don't have enough food. Okay, we don't I have don't to feed see them. I any of you stepping up to make the hard decisions. My girl's got more balls than all of you combined. Dad, please. Why don't you go help Mark with the wall? Just go have a heart attack again. That was funny. <clears throat> you know what? If you think I'm doing such a shitty job, then you do it. That's all the food we have for today. You decide who gets to eat. Dude, I want some fucking No, I'm serious. Pick now. up that food and start handing it out. You see how it feels to not have enough food for everyone. Feed the children first, and then eat the children. You didn't hear that. Where are the batteries? Come on! <clears throat> you need to give Clem some nutrition. She needs those batteries. Can I just, like, not feed anybody? Is that an option? That'd be hilarious. I just like, nope, not feeding anyone. Fuck you. Alright. What up? How you doing for the time? Okay. I didn't even do Where's anything. I don't know. Can you help me find it? Sure. I mean, what like, why wouldn't you? you I that'd be a, a dick move. Days ago. I promise. If I find it, I'll let you know. Thank you. Okay, Claire. I've got to take care of some things. Why don't you go back to playing with Duck for a while? And Ben. Okay. Um. <coughs> Fuck. As I said, no. Here, Clem. You need something to eat. Oh. She looks so sad. Um. <coughs> Apple. I love apples. I Thank fucking you. love apples too. Are there more? No, honey. 
That was the last one. Oh, um... Enjoy it. You deserve it. She's a strong little girl. Uh... What up? That walkie thing walkie. doesn't work anymore, does it? No, not since it broke at the drugstore. Just gonna hold on to it then? Yeah, if that's okay. I, um, I need it. It's or what? Okay. If it's broke, then whatever. You said they'd find us. I know, I did. And until then... Look, uh, Clementine. I'm not stupid, Lee. I know it's just pretend. But it makes me feel better. Okay, you take good care of it then. I will. Why is she petting it? How are you doing, Clementine? Everything all right? Yeah. Is that man going to be okay? Uh... It doesn't look good, Clementine. It doesn't look good. Oh, okay. I like how you just know she's like, all right. Fuck it. You know what? Meat. Hey, Doc. <coughs> how about a little food? Texting jerky, you fucking cunt. Yeah! Oh, man, I'm so hungry! Uh, go. Lily has me handing out the food. Ugh, that can't be an easy job. It's not. I won't be able to feed everyone. What should I do? Well, if you wanted to get in good with Lily, I'd make sure Larry gets some food, even though that guy can be a real dick sometimes. On the other hand, giving that food to Kenny and his family might make him remember you, if he decides to take off in that RV one day. What about you? You need food, too. We all need food. I can't tell you what to do, but whatever happens, I know you'll be trying to do the right thing. I really like Carly. She's Thanks, awesome. Carly. Don't I have two things of cheese and crackers? Uh... <clears throat> Back in a bit. Fuck you, Larry. Yo, Kenny. What up? Want some food? Want something to eat? Here, Kenny. Take this. How about my boy? He eat yet? Yeah, I gave him something. Sure, then hand it over. I'm starved. Thanks. Hmm. Well, gotcha. Some of these people have gone longer Wait. than me without food. They're the ones that need I'll it. I'll give it Yo. What up? Word's getting out that you want to leave the motor in. That ain't no secret, Lee. It's probably our best bet. Probably. I mean, Look, we can't just stay You've been here. good to me and my family. You saved Duck from those monsters. And you stood up to Larry at the drugstore. Because he's a dick. Don't forget that. You and Clem are welcome to come with us. I mean, we're gonna have to leave eventually. Coast does sound like a smart idea. Maybe that is the best thing. I know that it is. I'm taking my family. Anything else? I, I mean, she is right, but like... <sighs> she's not right at the same time. Lily has a point about these new people being extra mouths to feed. I know, but... Maybe the problem isn't that there isn't any food, there just isn't any here. We gotta think about moving on. We do. I mean, I agree with both of them. Like, we can't really take new people in, but we kind of have to. We need to expand a civilization. That's the only way to survive in the apocalypse, I guess. Have a lot of food and... Carver's Place in Season 2 had it right. Like, they had it fucking load. Loaded and shit. If Clementine was in charge of that, oh my god, do you realize how long they would survive? They, they'd probably survive to the end of it. Even though there is no end of it. Thanks for buying me time to get zombies. that guy out of the bear trap back there. I can't believe you cut off his leg. I don't know if I could have done it. Well, you told me to. Have a did. Was that of the <laughs> walkers? Let's hope things turn for the better. Soon. Now there's a statement I can get behind. Yep. Anything else? 
Nope, silent agreement. All right, let's go. How's it going, Lee? From up here, it looks like you're playing favorites. Fuck you. All right? Fuck you. Yo. Hmm. <clears throat> Should I? The other cut. Mm. Fuck Here, you. Eat something. <sighs> Why don't you give it to Doc? I'm a little busy with your mess right now. I gave Is it to Doc. Is he gonna be already. okay? I don't know. Can you give me a hand real quick? Sure. Sure. What do you need? Just apply some pressure here while I try to close this up. You know, I thought I was starting to get used to this, sewing up people's injuries. But I mean, cuts and bruises are one thing, but Lee, this man has no leg. I mean, he has one. I did the right thing. Yeah, I know you did. The right thing is She just sounded so sarcastic. Yeah. I know you did. Well, you've done all you can, Lee. Thanks for the help. Go ahead and check in on the others. You should probably wash your hands. Anyway. <clears throat> so what you're saying is you don't want food. Wait, did I give her the food? Do I have the food? That, that's not the right button. How do I... <coughs> do I have the food? Alright. All right, can I still give people food? Will you hold the damn board steady? I'm trying. I, I didn't realize I was getting this weak already. What do you want? A handout? Uh, I got 60 cents in my pocket. If you'll shut up and quit being such a pansy. This, this, this is why nobody likes you. Alright. Can I just give it to Lily? Is that an option? I've tried. I can! Fuck you, Carly. Want something to eat? Here. What up? Me? How about you? You look like crap, Lee. When was the last time you ate? I'm okay. I want you to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. For fuck's sake. I know I said it didn't matter why you saved me instead of Doug, but... You don't owe me anything, Carly. Can you just... Mm, this bitch. What the... Oh, no, not Kenny, not Kenny. Carly. That was... I don't know. Sleeping any better? No. I know we should be grateful for beds, but no. <coughs> not. Right. Drugstore? Yeah. Back in a bit. Shit. What do I do? I'm not giving it to Ben. He's a little shit bird. Fine, I'll give it to Larry. Yo. I don't trust this dude. Fucking Markiplier looking at Yo. <sighs> Take Here, the Larry. fucking crackers. Lily would want you to keep your strength up. That girl needs to quit worrying about me so much. Oh, man. Just seeing the food is driving me crazy. My bad. You need any help with the wall? Nope. Actually, we could use your axe. Do you mind if we take it? Yeah, um, give us that thing for a bit. <clears throat> I know I said I don't trust Mark, but I trust him more to not give to to pull to not give me the axe back if you know what i mean here mark this should help so thanks hey i'm the one doing all the work over here you didn't think to give me the axe i thought about it come on larry but then give i realized that i wanted it in the back i'm of my sure head. lee is getting pretty sick of you thinking he's a danger to the group is that what you told him yes there yeah, that's right yes, and what are that you going to do about it look I don't care what it is, but you two have got to start trying to get along. He's a dick. The only thing I fixed, so I would have. Appreciate it if you two would shut up and let me get back to work. You're a dick. I say that a lot, because he's a dick. What the fuck is he doing? Not such an easy job, is it? I don't envy you. I don't know how you have the strength to do this every day. I don't have a choice. Hey, 
Thanks for looking out for me and my family. I'm serious about that offer to come with us. You've more than earned a ride on the RV with me. Still, I guess some people aren't going to be happy with your choices. I, I mean, I tried to ask Katya if she wanted some. Ken! Lee! Come here, please. He didn't make it, did he? He lost too much blood. God damn it. Can I have that axe back for a shit. second? Ken, come back. There's nothing... I'm sick of this shit, too. You don't think I am? Uh, I don't know. Maybe it's for the best. We're already hmm. struggling to feed our own kids. That man you brought, I tried, but he was never Again, Axe, well, please. A problem anymore. What about the other kid? He's a fucking loser. <laughs> oh. 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 I'ma just... <clears throat> I'ma just stop him right there, bro. Right? Boy. Bro, I don't... Buddy, I don't appreciate this, right? I'm gonna... Move, move. Shit, it's stuck! Fucking... Yeah. Sort of Boy. Boy. You don't need to see, right? <coughs> My god. I should have just okay? given it to Larry. He probably hit the right part. Well, he probably hit, hit me with it. Why'd you bring him here in the first place, asshole? Dad, calm down. You're gonna get us all killed! Why didn't you tell us he was bitten? What? He was bitten, and you didn't say a goddamn word! But he wasn't bitten, I swear! Well, your not-bitten friend here came back to life and tried to kill my wife! What?! Wait, you all don't know? What the hell are you talking about? It's not the bite that does it. You come back no matter how you die. If you don't destroy the brain, that's just what happens. It's gonna happen to all of us. Infected? Everyone? I I guess well, so. Well, shit. I don't know. I all I know is that I've seen people turn who I know were never bitten. When I first saw it happen, we were all hiding out in a gym, and everybody thought we were finally safe. But one of the girls, Jenny Pitcher, I think. I guess she couldn't take it. She took some pills, a lot of them. Damn. Someone went in the girls' room the next morning, and God. Back off! Whoa, lady, relax. Me and my brother, we we just want to know if y'all can help us out. I said back off, Carly. Wait. Good. We don't want any trouble. Of course, uh, n neither do we. Uh, I'm Andy St. John. This here's my brother, Dan. We're just out looking for gasoline. Looks like you folks got the motel locked down, which, which is fine, but... Uh, could spare any gas, well, we'd be much obliged. Why do you need gas? Our place is protected by an electric fence. Generators provide they the electricity. Gas, so they can our generators run on gas. All over our Look, place and we own a dairy us. farm a few miles up the road. If y'all be willing to lower your guns, we, we can talk about some kind of trade. How y'all doing on food? We got plenty at the dairy. Lee, why don't you and Mark check the place out? See if it's legit. I'm going with you. I got your back if anything seems fishy. So, uh, what do y'all think? I mean, food. You've got a deal. We'll bring some gas to your dairy. In exchange, you give us some food to bring back. We'll see how it goes from there. Sounds fair. A couple gallons should power one of our generators for a while. So, this dairy, you guys really have food? Sure do. We lost most of the cattle, but we still have Why lots ben of milk, with butter, us? and cheese stocked up. And with the vegetables we grow, we got plenty of food. It's nice to get away from that motel for a while. This Lily Kenny thing is starting to get ridiculous. It is kind Personally, of I'd be happier if you started to take charge more. I mean... 
You think they'd want me for a leader? Sure. Everybody looks up to you. Well, not everyone thinks I'm so trustworthy. Because of your past. Does anyone else know? Larry knows. Great. That can't be easy. Clementine nope. knows. She was there when we were talking in the drugstore and asked me about it. I couldn't lie to her. What exactly I mean, why would you? did happen with the senator? It was an accident. I mean, I, I pretty much knew about the affair. Sometimes I wonder if I should talk to the group about it. You don't have to. Whatever happened before things went to hell doesn't matter anymore. Not sure everyone would see it that way. Maybe you're right. Listen, over the years, I've reported on some pretty messed up shit. I've seen situations like yours a hundred times. It doesn't have to make you a bad man. I, uh, really appreciate that. I, I mean, it. thank God Lee showed up when he did. Right, Lee? Yeah, why don't what? you tell us a little more about yourself, Lee? Where are you from? Macon. I grew up in Macon. Right here in the heart of Georgia. That's what I like to hear. Y'all seem pretty settled in at that motor inn. Uh, who's running things over there? Uh, it's a democracy. Bitch, where? Lily. Lily. Runs a pretty <coughs> tight ship. Her and her dad are ex-military. Yeah, she knows her shit, but she needs to know when to back off sometimes. That is true. How many people you got over there anyway? Lots. Enough to defend ourselves. Well, that's good. It's getting dangerous out there. Well, you guys know. I'm not ready well, to trust these guys. We'd love to get you all Especially out to the Like I said, we got plenty of food, and quite frankly, we could always use an extra helping hand. In the summers, I used to help out on a goat farm. Yeah, that's great. Everything helps. Mama's been running the dairy for well, as long as so I can so remember. But, uh, yeah, that's it's great. You think Everything you helps. Out of this? No one's trying to cut you out of anything. You and Gary are always pumping this shit. Fucking oh, Gary and their those look like bullshit. Who are they? Fuck you. You knew we were hungry. And you guys were keeping it up. There's only two of them. Oh no, there's Yeah, and you know what? More. We ate it all. What are you gonna fucking do about it? Don't worry. Danny and I got you covered if something happens. But let's just wait this out. I hope they move on. Fuck you! Damn. Jesus! Asshole! The world out here is going to shit. Come on, let's get to the dairy where it's safe. What the fuck's the point? I mean, like, if everyone just banded together, it would be so easy. Juggernuggets indeed. Here it is. St. John Family Dairy. <laughs> Y'all can see how we kept this place so safe. The fence keeps no, them out. Only we had that on her. You betcha. They fry like bugs in a zapper. We're pushing 4,000 volts through that thing with generators and amps. I'm going to assume that's a lot. That's a huge bitch. Uh, We've got kids in our group. Doesn't seem safe to have them near a lethal fence. Oh, don't worry about that. We got plenty to keep them entertained. This place looks untouched. You never know the rest of the world is in ruins. It's worth protecting. Hence all what do you mean by rest of the world? So I is the actual world just fucked up come or down is the drive? Just I'm Guys, still confused. This is our mama. I'm Brenda St. John and welcome to the St. John Dairy. This here's Lee. He's from Macon. A couple of our old farm hands were from Macon. They grow them good there. They got a few more friends okay. staying at the old motel. Oh my goodness, that place is pretty vulnerable. Have you got someone with survival experience to lead your group? Uh. Lily. It's tough as nails and keeps us focused on what it takes to survive. Lily was in the military, like me. Well, that's good to hear. That motel ain't the safest place. Now that y'all are here, we'll make sure you're safe and comfortable. Does that offer apply to the rest of us? We're all incredibly hungry. These are for y'all. Baked fresh this morning. 
Amazing. There's biscuits. Can't get stuff like that anymore. I want a biscuit. Not without a cow for milk and butter, that's for I sure. I want a biscuit. That's right. I Hopefully Maybelle will make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be with us for a good long while. Your cow is sick? What's she? We have a vet. We could bring her here. We can help you folks out. <laughs> Not a, a vet? fucking oh my. cow vet. Our prayers have been answered. Maybe our whole group could come for the day. Well, how about this? Y'all go get your veterinary friend, and I'll prepare some dinner. A big feast for all you hungry souls. It'll be nice to have some folks to help out around here again. Danny, why don't you come help me out in the kitchen? Why don't I head back with the food and round up everyone for the trip over here? Might want to take someone with you. Remember, those roads can be dangerous. I can handle myself. Take this. She can. Why don't you go ahead She's and take that along anyway? Take care of yourself, Lee. See you in a while. All right, Mark. Let's Mark, make Lee, sure this. Why don't you take a look legit. around? Once you get settled in, I could use some help securing the perimeter. Is there a problem? Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. You can learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generators before they run dry. Come get me when you're ready. You betcha. This place is incredible. <clears throat> it's got food. And that fence? Oh man, that fence. If we play our cards right, this might turn out to be a place we can stay. So how do you want to play this? Hmm. I mean... Before we can think about bringing our whole group here to stay, we need to figure out if this place is as safe as they're telling us. Right. Obviously they think it's safe. But is it safe enough for the kids? I noticed a broken swing over there. Not a big deal, but maybe there's other things not working that we just can't see yet. And checking the fence perimeter? Sounds like a decent way to get a good look at their defenses. Alright, I'll keep my eyes open, and you find out what you can from Andy. Alright. So... Fence. Where's the swing? I'm lost. That's the swing. Too bad it's broken. I'll bet Clementine and Duck would have loved something like this to play on. Kids used to like that old swing even more than the tour sometimes. <laughs> I'll bet. Mind if I fix it? <coughs> sure, that'd be great. Mama sure does appreciate y'all helping out. Looks like it just needs a new board for the seat and some rope. Make it safe for Clem and Duck. And let the St. John's know we can pull our weight around here. Yeah, we can pull our weight on a swing. Wait, where's my axe? Is it just in my back pocket? Alrighty then. This is too big right now, but if I can find something to cut it down. Oh, size, I wonder what. You know, it's not like there's a the saw right next to it or anything. Mind if I use one of these boards? Already making some repairs, huh? I like a guy who takes some initiative. Yeah, go right ahead. You're not gonna sand it down first? Already then. <laughs> I need some rope. Yeah, you got it in your rope. Yeah, what up? Hi. Hi. You got it in your well, rope? I'm glad you guys decided to help us out. I noticed back at the motel that you folks are pretty well armed. Been stockpiling, huh? Yep. Yeah, if anyone tries to fuck with us, they'll regret it. Well, protecting your people is important, but. In my experience, having that many guns around is when people get dangerous. 
Can't be the first people you've invited up to the dairy. Well, no, we've made similar deals with other folks, uh, trading for gas and food, but ultimately they moved on, looking for the people they lost contact with. And heaven. I'm gonna get to know the place for a minute. Okay, well, we gotta secure the perimeter, so <coughs> don't take too long. I need some rope. Yeah, you got any rope? It's your so boy. What have you found out? Is this looking like a good place to stay? I need I'll a rope. Around. All right, keep me posted. Does anybody know where some rope is? I need some rope. I think. The board is good, but I need some rope. Where the hell do I get rope? Rope. What up? Hey, Mama, I got some rope. Well, hi there, Lee. What can I do for you, sweetie? I need some rope. Can I help you with anything around the house? I think Andy, he's got a lot. Of weight on his I need shoulders some rope. Day, so I'm sure he'd love any help he can get. How many rooms does this house have? Rooms? Why do you ask? Uh. It looks custom built. Nice of you to notice. My husband put a lot of work into this old house. Well, he did a fantastic job. I believe in making a house a home. I mean. Your family's done an amazing job of keeping this place up. Well, now aren't you sweet? Thank <coughs> you. The boys and I have tried to adapt as best we can, but we still keep some of our old routines to help remind us of better times. Fair enough. What happened to the rest of your staff? Oh, we've had our share of tragedy here. Just like everyone else, I'm sure. Well, that some sucks. Some of our staff took off to find their family as soon as they heard the news. The few that stuck around, well, we lost most of them the first night those things showed up here. It was oh, a tough night. That sucks. Dinner. Well, dinner be ready. It'd be a while still, but it'd be worth it. Trust me. How's your family been holding up since, uh, you know? All my boys have been my saving grace. They both left their jobs and came home to help. Alright, I got it. Do you have any rope? Started happening. I think it was hardest on Andy. I, st I still need Andy this rope. Andy was always more of a mama's boy. But don't tell him I said that. <laughs> well, if anything comes up that I can help with, feel free to let me know. Well, Lee, I sure appreciate Lee it. Lee asked about the rope. Rope. Mmm, fresh herbs. <laughs> I can hardly wait for dinner. Can I use those as a rope? Is there any rope in here? I there's some rope in here. I need some rope. Hey, the rope! This rope is perfect for the swing. Cool. Got some rope. Hail. Yes. I have rope! I am Lord of all! Alright. This shouldn't be too tough. I'll be damned. Mama's gonna be thrilled to see that old swing all fixed up. Hopefully our kids will like it too. Did you say something, darling? Oh my goodness. Did you do that? Did Just I do trying that? to help out a bit around here. You know, I used to push Andy and his brother out here on that swing every night when they were kids. And then I got really fat and broken. Like so, a long time. story on how, um... Yeah, it does. Brooks. More you know. I did that. Look at all my hard work. Look at it. Admire it. Okay, I'm done. I'm over it.
Well, I think that's gonna be about it. That's all I have time for. We got like... <coughs> I'm sick. We had like... Fucking half? Quarter? Quarter half? Quarter half. We had a quarter half of the episode done. Yay. So I'm gonna just end stream now. Because I'm bad at this. Yeah.